always pull all your screws out before you try to take the forms off. <clears throat> Pro tip of the day right there. Forms don't come off when they're still screwed onto something. All right, this one turned out pretty decent. Got a smooth finish with a seal on it. Uh, gonna get ready to do this last section here. So just stuck up our expansion joint up along the existing concrete and put down a little bit of Visqueen. Um, it's already into the afternoon, so this will probably be another one of those night projects, the way it's going. So let's get to work. Well, it's getting pretty late. I've hit that once or twice with a uh, hand float. Trying to get it to dry, uh, but it's been pretty slow. It's getting getting late, like I said, and it's cold out. I can see my breath, so. Uh, I don't wanna pull an all-nighter, so we're gonna get on it with a steel trowel, see what happens. See what's right up underneath this against the edge, but 
still try to make it look best we can. Once again, this is a chicken coop, so you're really never going to see this concrete. It's going to be covered in chicken. some sealer on this hopefully and uh, we'll call the floor portion of this project done. up against the existing concrete that we poured here the other day <clears throat> and now I'm kind of edging right up against it on today's port and my idea is that I will get uh, some kind of joint sealant and just fill this whole joint so nothing like uh, no water or anything. Hopefully it'll get down in that joint with that expansion. That's the that's the hope anyway. As you can see, this is still way too wet. Well, I still trialed it once, and it's about midnight right now, so I think uh, maybe I'll give it one more hour. I'll give it one more hour, I'll hit it again, then we're going to call it good. Well, here it is, finished and sealed. So thank you for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.